Good morning, this is Maria Lane and I have a message for you. Um, we could be a little distracted by the dog, Bonnie. She is full of beans right now, but it's too, well it's not really that cold, but I could put her outside, but I choose not to. She's part of the family. So today I felt inspired to do a message for you. And I'm not going to say it's for the week ahead. It's just a message because sometimes people stumble across these two, three years down the track. So my belief is if you're listening to this today, there is something in there for you. And I would like to add an angel number to this message. So let's see how that flows. I love my angel numbers. First inspiration that happened to me about 12 months ago. I just look at a random number. It catches my eye. It could be anywhere. On the desk here I look it up and it always seems to just fit perfectly with the cards so I do enjoy listening to intuition um, you know once you have an awareness of how powerful those guiding words are it can take you to places that you don't even imagine and um, for those of you who may be watching me for the first time today um, this art behind me is a result of that three, four, almost four years ago now, um, I felt the inspiration to draw, or actually I started rock painting, and I went on to YouTube to look for an instructional video on how to do gratitude rocks, and you know how they have those little um, suggested videos down the side, and there was one there that caught my eye, and it was for a mandala, a mandala, and I thought, oh, that looks interesting. So I clicked on that. It was only five or six minutes and I was hooked. And from that moment, the it's just been a progression. I started with mandalas, black and white mandalas. Then I introduced colors. Then someone asked me, are you doing a Zentangle? And I had no idea what a Zentangle was. So I looked it up and I found out what that was. So I explored Zentangles. I moved on to painted rocks and pots. Then I started dabbling with watercolour and now I'm up to acrylics and I haven't had any formal instruction, it's all through YouTube. I've just found the time and the love and the passion. So, okay, that's how that all unfolded. So if you get a, a desire or some sort of burning push to do something, cards are dropping left, right and centre here, um, please follow it through. And today is a, I'm not an astrologer, I deeply want to explore this, it's on my to-do list one day. Um, I follow a lot of astrologers. And today is a grand water trine. And what does that mean? It means that the three water planets, Pisces, Cancer and Scorpio, they're forming a triangle in the sky, so that means it's very powerful energy. Um, they're very they're a rare alignment and it's if you're watching this today on the day I think it's a three or four day window of this grand water trine listen to your intuition there is something in there for you I believe any action that you take under this energy is going to be very positive a positive step forward so listen to that calling and if not just jot any ideas down you might not be ready to, to pursue them right now but just put them down on paper and maybe one day you'll just wake up and go yep I'm gonna do that so okay that's the message the lead-in and here are the cards please no sneeze no sneezing. <laughs> it's a little bit cold here I've just come back from a walk it's very very frisk okay um, brisk <laughs> it was a frisk a brisk walk oh what a beautiful card to start off with the universe card thank you that's so lovely. So this card is just validation about everything that I possibly said about, you know, following your passion, listening, listening to your intuition, taking inspiration today of all days, you know, with this beautiful energy around. The universe is going to support you, um, send you the help that you need, send you the resources that you need when you're lined up vibrationally with that intention. So you have to feel, feel it. It's no good. <laughs> I wouldn't recommend looking at this card and just going, oh yeah, that's not going to happen for me. Because just those, that sentiment will actually put the floodgates down and say, no, it won't happen for you. You've got to believe with passion. Like there's no doubt whatsoever. Excellent. Beautiful card to start off with. So the next card we have is, oh, 
Oh, <laughs> this is really awesome. This is the Destiny card. I don't know what, what else I can say. That's just fabulous. Please, I'd love you to leave a message. I'm getting goosebumps all over. Goosebumps all over about this, this flow of cards. So leave a comment under this video to say, you know, what you would like to what you're thinking, what you're feeling, you know, what can you do? And it could be something completely different to what you're currently doing. I think the universe is saying, have faith in your ability. Have faith in yourself. You can actually do anything your heart desires. And like I said, it's our, it's the world that we live in that says you must have a university degree to do this. You, or you must have this piece of paper to do this. You need to be qualified to do this. Sure, certain fields, that is a requirement, but a lot of the creative fields, no, you don't. You just need passion and inspiration and drive. Okay, last card. <laughs> Here we go, Passion Ignited. How awesome is that? Now, I'm, I don't need to say any more. These three cards just virtually just, yeah, is enough for you to say, yep, I'm going to do it. Thank you, Mary Lane. So t today of all days, if you are watching this, Please, please promise me, Pinky promise me, that you will take some action. So now let me just find my um, my angel number to go with this. I just want to show you how random this will be. Okay, so this is some rubbing alcohol that I used to clean some surfaces before I paint. And I'm looking for the number here and we've got 2094. So I've just taken the numbers off the bottom of the... Um, what are they, the ISB, or I'm not quite sure what that international code is, but anyway, 2094. That's how scientific or how creative I get when it's time to choose those angel numbers. Now, if you're still with me, I just want to say I have started another YouTube channel. I will continue this one. Um, but this more is a collection of Murray Elaine messages. It's a copy of this one. Um, Spirit, where I've found some other um, videos about spiritual awareness which I can share legally I'm not infringing on any copyright I'm not into that sort of thing at all and the other one is art and that again is just a collection of artists who are willing to allow people to share their works so that's what I'm doing on this channel so and finally the next round of 21 days is starting on the 11th of July so every month where there is 31 days we do a 21 day um, little program, um, it's building momentum, I had some ideas before and that's why I'm so excited about these cards. Um, this round is all about self worth, so if you would like to join us, it's no cost, only your time, jump into or search Facebook for 21 days, request entry in, we're starting on Wednesday the 11th, we'll be uploading a video not a video, we'll be uploading an inspirational post, there'll be some small tasks for you to do daily, but mainly it'll be more reflection and increasing your vibrational energy so that you are in alignment with your soul's purpose. And the stepping stone to that is to believe first that you are so worthy of doing this. Okay, thank you very much. I'm really excited to be sharing this message. Thank you, Bonnie, for being nice and not being too disruptive. So, um, yeah, I'm excited to put this up. Love to hear your thoughts. Thank you. Bye.